Here's a video on how to add memory to a Synology 1515 Plus. First you remove the five screws from the back. Then you remove the drive trays in the front. You'll see the uh, memory slot over to the uh, side with the motherboard and heatsink. And there's two openings. On the rectangular opening, you can see, if you look closely, two clips that are on each side of the memory, as you can see here. If you've never installed memory before or removed memory, take a look at the blue mother sideboard on the outside and you can see how the memory can go in and out. But you, once you uh, remove the clips, you'll be removing the memory through the yellow opening, I mean the round opening as seen here. It comes out pretty easily, so there's nothing you need to force, you just need to loosen the clips on each side. So there's the Synology memory, the two megabytes, not uh, gigabytes. I got the crucial uh, 16 gigabyte kit from Amazon, you'll see the link in the description. And when I put it back in, I uh, went through the same circle opening right above the uh, heatsink. Here's a close up detail. Try to take some pictures so it's uh, it was hard to get the video camera in there at the same time. But you want to slowly slide it at a 45 degree angle with the, uh, the uh, chip side in first. Again, you should practice on the outside just to see uh, how easily it goes in. Since I was having some trouble, I rotated it so that the mother side was down, motherboard side was down. And just in case it fell, it will just fall flat. And once it was uh, inserted, all I had to do is press down and the clips engaged on both sides. You can see the white clip on the right, it will snap into place. Here's a close up of it. Also, one thing you might want to check is uh, if your Synology is brand new like mine, I just plugged it in to ensure it booted up and it did. So the hard part's done. Now you'll just be putting the RAM on the outside if you haven't done so already. And since it's easily, easily accessible, you'll just uh, find the right notch and put it in at about 45 degrees like that and it'll snap into place. Just ensure the snaps are on both sides. And that's it. Now you just reverse the process of putting your Synology back together. Of course I uh, put drives into this, but I wanted to check if uh, my system booted up, and it did. But when I did boot it up, it said I had to add some hard drives first, so I came back downstairs and inserted the drives. So just uh, replace the screws, the five screws in the back, and you'll be all set. And just put your old memory in a safe place in case you need it for later. And that's how you add RAM to the uh, Synology 1515 Plus. Hope you enjoyed it. Click like if you did. Thank you.